or maybe I go out there and I try and convert them to modern ways and then they feed me some geese sausage and I take the most amazing dump of all time, like a nice solid log the next day. And then I start killing the geese in my local park because I find out, man, those Haitians were really onto something. The geese are free. They're easy to capture. They're delicious. They're soft in your stomach. They're high in protein. I mean, is anyone going to delve into whether or not we should all be eating geese? They're annoying. They, 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 I, I've always fantasized uh, when the geese, because they get, they get, they, they like to puff out their chest, and then they pretend they got their long necks and they pretend like they're a cobra. And you're like, you're a fucking geese. You think I can't take you? I've, I've fantasized before grabbing a geese by its head and then just boom, boom, and beating the shit out of the other geese. I would never do it. I mean, I have crazy thoughts all the time about running my car and people. I wouldn't do it. But I'm just saying, when, when, when the geese starts giving me shit, you sit in there. And you're like, oh, you know what? I'm going to think about the universe. I'm going to think about it. And then some geese comes by and tries to chase you out of your spot. And you're like, right, listen, you, 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 just because you dropped your little thin turds all over this park doesn't make this your park, you stupid Canadian geese. You, you, you're, you're the literal shit that comes down from Canada and puts shit in our parks. I didn't like Canada anyways. If it was up to me, we'd burn all your forest fires and build the wall up there and keep your stupid Canadian horse shit out of here. You want to talk about people taking our jobs. It's all these funny uh, Canadian comedians. You know, it's the it's the Ryan Longs, the J, the J.J. Liebermans of the world. You know how many uh, comedians from Canada who are funny come to New York and take our, our comedy club spots? Those are the real immigrants that are taking our jobs. So that's what I say. we got to build the wall with Canada. And if there's one thing that we should eradicate as a showcase of our anti-Canadian socialism attitude that had no support for their truckers, were the first to undermine our non-banking financial systems for uh, supporting grassroots organizations that were willing to oppose government tyranny. It's the Canadian geese. So maybe the Haitians have had it right this whole time. I don't know. Has anyone here eaten Canadian geese? If anything, I say I go to Springfield, Ohio. We go to the park. We take out our bow and arrows. We capture geese. And uh, we do the first-hand journalism of finding out whether or not they're delicious. And, you know, maybe maybe we'll, we'll, we'll hire a Haitian chef to prepare the geese properly for us. Because if you're just going to slaughter a geese in the park, I don't know how to cook it. Do, do, is it a slow cook? Uh, you got to fry it? Does it got tough skin? You know, everything, uh, everything's got to be cooked properly. I can't just show up to some, some old rich lady's place, slaughter a horse, and make a good horse burger. I wouldn't know how to do that. I bet horses taste better as steak. I bet that I bet if you're going to eat a horse, you want it to be a nice cut of steak. I bet you want a nice hind leg, like right where maybe that's too tough. But that maybe is what gets you like the human growth hormones. Maybe that's what heals your injuries. So I'm just saying, who's doing the real journalism of actually showing up to Springfield, Ohio and eating a geese to find out whether or not they're delicious? And if there's an animal that I would support the killing of, it actually, you know what? I'm doing a 180 on this and thinking maybe the Haitians know something that we don't because geese are annoying creatures, the representative of the tyranny of Canada, and for all we know, they're delicious. Thank you for that comment.